I'm Amar Madhani. I'm a White House reporter for the Associated Press. Uh, and what the Associated Press has just learned is that uh, President Zelensky will be making his first trip outside of Ukraine since uh, the February invasion by Russia. And he'll be coming to Washington on Wednesday uh, to visit both the White House uh, and make a speech at the U.S. Capitol. Now, things are very fluid. It is possible that this uh, could have to be scrapped for security reasons. Uh, but both the White House and Congress are preparing for Zelensky to come. This is significant for multiple reasons. Uh, the war is at a, another inflection point. It's at a fraught moment for Zelensky. Uh, the Ukrainians want to make sure that the American support for the war continues as uh, control of Congress is about to change from uh, Democrats to Republicans in the weeks ahead. Uh, and it's also an important moment because Ukraine's about to get $45 billion more um, promised uh, for the next piece of fighting. So Zelensky uh, sort of left, left to what uh, some are seeing as sort of an Easter egg about this visit. Uh, he was on the front lines giving out awards to Ukrainian forces that are in, really in, in the thick of this. And uh, he was given a flag that he promised to hand on um, from the Ukrainian forces that they meant to be a uh, token of thanks to the U.S. for the support that's been given uh, to Ukraine in fighting the war thus far. Ten months ago, no one expected Ukraine to be standing at this point. They expected the Russians to have prevailed. For him to come at this moment, um, it's, it's a big deal. It's a chance for him to show that U.S. investment has paid off in Ukraine.